of your sons, for example, or children um, will not have uh, dental checkups, for example. It's just something as simple as preventative. It no longer exists. They can only go now. And all of these, uh, if, if they have a toothache, sorry, or, or they need an extraction. Um, but all of these things are because of the government's mismanagement of our finances. They don't happen by coincidence. It's not a bad, bit of bad luck. It's not down to COVID. There's a litany and a whole stream of reasons where they've mismanaged. So there's a whole load of financial mismanagement, which has led to the de decrease in the quality of our lives. That is why I'm here. To also pay attention to everyone across our society, not just those at the top, but everyone. And, I'm, and you're going to hear me saying this time and time again, during these elections, because for me that's a very big deal. Um, I deal with a lot of people um, in my line of work um, who are, they're, they're just shunned, they're, they're set aside. Um, and and it's, it's the poorer in our society who, who have the worst um, impact of everything that's going on at the minute. Foremost thing I think for me is um, it's listening, um, which is something that this government doesn't seem to do very well.